Week two battle pass missions. Let's go. How is it going everybody? Lucian Sword here and today we are going to be working on our week two battle pass missions. As you can see I already have a little bit of progress made on these but we still have a long ways to go. And I know a lot of people were saying that the week one missions were too easy. And for the most part, the week two missions are still pretty easy to do, so no worries there. Let's take a look real quick. So we have hit opponents that are above the top camera bounds. That's actually not as hard as it sounds, probably. Uh, you'll get that just by going for people up in the sky, but uh, you don't even have to get the KO. Just have to tap them when they're off the camera. Scythe KOs, that's pretty straightforward. As you can see, I've been working on that. Gauntlet heavy attack and blaster light attack damage. The, the easiest and fastest way to get these two is just by going into free-for-all because then you have three different targets to do damage on. Win matches with current battle pass color scheme. This one's actually interesting because I know that uh, there's people out there that probably don't have Frozen Forest for their favorite legends. Which means you may be forced to play a legend you don't really know or are unfamiliar with. Uh, that's a good thing in my opinion. It'll make everybody you know try other legends that they don't normally play possibly and unfortunately I see I don't even have a blaster legend unlocked with frozen forest colors so I'm not gonna be able to do that at the same time as the uh, blaster light attack damage but it's okay ground pound KOs 100 ground pound KOs and by the way guys don't worry if you think that you're not gonna finish the mission in the week uh, you don't have to you can finish, you can work on these missions the entire length of the battle pass. You don't have to finish them in the first week or whatever. So I, I have a feeling that even I'm not going to be able to finish the 100 ground pound KOs in the first week. And then gravity cancel unarmed heavy attacks. That's pretty easy to do. You just have to remember to get the gravity cancel unarmed heavy. You can't just do an unarmed heavy KO. You have to gravity cancel it. And that's why I keep messing up on this one. Other than that, they're pretty easy. So, um... I, I guess I should work on my Blaster Light Attack and my Scythe KOs. So, let's play a game with Nyx, because then we can work on both of those. Unfortunately, I don't have Frozen Forest uh, colors with Nyx, so I can't work on that one. But that's okay, we'll get that one pretty easily in time. Like I said, we have the whole length of the Battle Pass to get these missions. Alright, going against Oblivion. Why do I always go against Oblivion in my, in my videos? I guess I haven't recently, but if you've been watching my channel for... You know, longer than a few months, you probably have seen Oblivion in my videos. <laughs> hey, feast, 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 skull! Alright, I need a uh, blaster light attack. I feel like we're doing. Great on this one. So far. Oh, he dodged right into that one, boy B. That is probably her best blaster sig, other than the neutral sig, of course. I do need scythe KOs, but right now, I think I'm just gonna work on the blaster light attack because... working how it's oh gosh that yep I knew I was gonna hit that get that right in the face oh no the down light please leave me alone please leave me alone Ooh. Ooh, god with that neutral sig blaster KO I'm not getting any scythe KOs but that's okay Oh, he got a ground pound KO. There you go, Oblivion. <laughs> Only 99 more to go. <laughs> Alright, Scythe, I don't even need light attack damage. I just need straight up KOs. Uh oh. I don't want to fight. No, I knew it. I didn't want to fight Gauntlets off the stage. Especially when he's on top of me like that. Oh, oh, got him with that. Oh, 
Never underestimate Oblivion, man. He is a very good player. If you underestimate him, you will lose. But, because I've played him so many times, I respect how good he is. I know that he is never going to give up. Alright, we got a ton of blaster light attack damage. GG, dude. GG. I did better there than I normally do, so I got lucky. GG, dude. Probably if I would have stayed with the scythe, he would have beat me. Because I'm not, <laughs> lately, I'm not feeling scythe. Like, it's it's good and it's bad for me. But, anyways, uh, let's keep it going. Oh, by the way, guys, I don't know if you saw in the dev stream yesterday, but they just showed off this picture of the new Luck of the Brawl skin. It's a Sentinel skin. I don't remember the name of it, but there you go. It's pretty awesome. And these are all the other Luck of the Brawl skins from the past and the avatars and everything you can get. Uh, they said this comes out March 17th, I think? So, a couple weeks from now, but yeah, pretty exciting. Alright, so I need... What else do I need here? I need Gauntlet Heavy Attack, and I need Blaster Light and Scythe KOs. Um, so, let's just use a Gauntlet Legend. I did Petra in my last video, so we're not going to do... Oh, let's do Mordex. He has Gauntlets and Scythe. Perfect, perfect. Um, should we go... Uh, let's go Black Diamond Mordex or Daimyo. I really do like Daimyo. Let's just go Daimyo Black. How about? But let's give him some better weapons. Because I'm not going to lie. Daimyo's weapons are a little bit lame. Let's give him... Mm, looking for a cool scythe. How about... Ooh, I do love Scare Rare. This scythe is awesome. And then for the gauntlets... Let's give him the Apocalypse Hands. Because these are actually the only gauntlets that are asymmetrical. Look, I'll show. I'll show. Uh, I guess you can't see it very easily on this. Yeah, you can't really see it because I have the black color scheme going on. All right, we're going against 2.71828182845. We're going against super long number guys. Is that the number pi? I'm gonna guess it is. All right, let's go. I need gauntlet, uh, gauntlet heavy attack. Right? Gauntlet Heavy Attack. Okay. There's a Scythe K. Oh, possibly no. Almost got the ground pound. That's okay. Boom! He just swung at air, man. I wasn't even moving. I was just standing there and he just swinged. I do need gravity cancel unarmed KOs. Oof. Uh, but I need to get him into red before I go for those. Ooh, that gauntlet heavy attack damage is going to work out, though. Goodbye, Volkov. I actually... Oh, guys, I got esports colors, right, from watching the uh, dev sprint stream. As I hope you guys were as well, but anyway... One of the one of the ones I got was Volkov. I'm excited to use that one. Ground pound KO. Ground pound. Ground pound. Gra gra ground pound. Ground pound. Nope. No. Yeet. Scythe KO. I think so. There it is. Oh yeah, we got Scythe KO. And I did some gauntlet heavy attack damage. We did a lot there. Let's see. GG dude, GG. 
Got one Scythe KO and 164 Gauntlet Heavy Attack. We're making good progress. Let's go. If you guys enjoyed this video, please drop a like. It really helps me out. Um, all right, let's try. What else do I need? Gauntlets. Blaster Light. I need a lot more Blaster Light Attack. Hmm. All right, let's go Lucian. I feel like I'm pretty decent with Lucian Blasters. And by the way, like I said before, guys, it would probably be a lot faster to do these in free for all. Like, it just is most of them, anyway. The ones where you have to do damage, because you're just gonna get so much more damage in free for all than you will in a 1v1. Like, it's very rare that you'll get over 1,000 damage, like, total in a 1v1. It's very rare, but it can be done. But in a free for all, like, I get over a thousand damage almost every game. You know what I mean? So it's, it's there's just so many more people to hit. All right, uh, I need blasters actually, but I guess I'll use guitars until I have them. No, I just killed myself because I'm stupid. Don't play like me, guys. Don't play like me. You're gonna do bad things. <laughs> Okay, blasters. This is what I wanted anyways. We'll give him the stock advantage. Ouch. The nice thing about blasters is that you can kill with the light attacks. Okay, reverse three stock right here. I'm calling it right now, reverse three stock. I ain't gonna lose like this with Lucid. Get out of here. Double slap. Get down there. Uh-uh. He knew that I had to save him. What? Boom. All right, there's the second. Now we got a three. We got to reverse three sock this guy. Easier said than done. There it is! Reverse three stock, let's go! <laughs> oh man! I called it! I called it, man. GG, dude, GG. Hit opponents that are above the top. Yeah, we got it! Let's go! I don't even remember getting it. I wasn't even going for it. We still got it. Feels good. We also got that blaster light attack damage. We got the ground pound KOs. And. Oh, I really wanted a blaster legend. With Frozen Force, I can make progress on that at the same time. Oh well. Um, let's take a look at our progress here. So, I'm still gonna work with the uh, Blaster Light Attack and the Gauntlet Heavy. So, let's use Cross. He has Blasters and Gauntlets. Mm, I'm gonna go Hellboy. Gonna go Hellboy Gala Colors. Look at that. It looks so cool. But let's upgrade his Blasters. Ooh, the Ripple and Wave look awesome. And let's give him some animated, uh, some animated Gauntlets here as well. Alright, so what I'm looking to do here is damage him up with the blasters and then finish him with a gauntlet heavy. But of course, that's the plan and nothing goes according to plan, so we'll see how it goes. I do need gravity cancel unarmed KO, so maybe I'll go for that. Depend depends on the depends on the person. Yo, 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 eat, 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 skull! Good read. Ooh. Beautiful Nyx neutral sig. Gotta respect it.
Don't be jumping above me so much, Nick. Oh, yeah. Give me that blaster light attack damage. Let's go. Doesn't Hellboy look awesome with those blasters? <laughs> Blaster damage. Woo! Close. Now's my chance for the unarmed gravity cancel. Oh. I think the best way to do that would be the downlight and then, yeah, I'll try to do it. Okay, I gotta be careful not to get gimped while I'm doing this. All right, well, ground pound KO I'll take. I was gonna say do like a downlight with the unarmed and then do a gravity cancel neutral heavy. Nice, nice, very close, Nyx. Oh, so close to that ground pound. She had a perfect recovery. Well done, well done. GG, mate, GG. All right, guys, well, that's gonna be it. Let's look at our progress. Oh, we almost caught up to our gauntlet heavy attack damage with the blasters, and we got another ground pound KO. Oh man, only 96 more ground pound KOs to go. <laughs> Again, free for all guys. Pick a hammer legend and just ground pound like crazy on free for all. Anyways, let me know uh, how you guys are doing on the battle pass missions in the comments below. Uh, let me know what level you are in the battle pass. Ooh, one more level and I get 15% boost XP. That's going to be great. Oh man. Well, you know, I'm happy to get Val, Flowers and Forest, but I would like to hopefully get a uh, Blaster Legend here on Tier 18. But anyways, guys, this is Lucian Sword. Thank you so much for watching. Be sure to subscribe for more Brawlhalla content. And as always, this is Lucian Sword. I hope to see you in the next video. Take it easy, friends.